With the passage of the transportation bill, uh, included in that was the Central Susquehanna Valley Thruway. And, um, you know, we just had the timeline laid out. Um, our Department of Transportation is working with the Federal Highway Administration to move that timeline up or make it a little faster. And tentatively, they hope to break ground uh, in August um, 2015, uh, have the contract let out in August 2014. Um, begin the design of the southern section of the project, uh, which would also make connected into the new bridge. And, um, you know, for the commuters, um, unfortunately, they don't expect completion until 2024 um, for everybody to be on the entire project. Uh, but until then, I mean, we're moving forward. Um, there's been talk about letting out smaller parts of the project so we can move it along a little faster. And I think the next three months, um, working closely with the Federal Highway Administration, we hope to be able to move the project along a little faster. Um, and try and meet the needs of the community as we're doing that. Um, but sooner than that, we'll have you know people them starting to work on the 160 deficient bridges, uh, the roadways that are needed repair, and a lot of our dirt and gravel roadways, which affect many of our townships. Um, you'll be able to see them come to a paved surface, uh, safer for our communities, and less pollution into our streams and waterways. So I think kind of an exciting time for all of us um, just to see where we go. And that's not to mention the money going to our local municipalities with the savings from prevailing wage, uh, what you'll see locally uh, impacting your communities and your commute.